We're hearing the moment the captain of the Spirit of Norfolk sent in a distress call about the fire on board Tuesday afternoon. The cruise ship likely a total loss after crews spent more than 24 hours trying to put the flames out. Now employees can't go back to their jobs on board. Ann Sparacco spoke to downtown Norfolk business owners who say they want to help them out. Just to confirm, you have approximately 108 personnel on board. Over. This captain's distress call for an emergency response on the spirit of Norfolk is bringing us to the moment when a fire broke out Tuesday afternoon. Okay, I might have an emergency right now. I'm off of NOB. I believe I have a fire in the engine room. The aftermath of the cruise ship giving managers very little hope of recovery. Business owners in downtown Norfolk say they immediately thought about what's next for the people who work on the spirit of Norfolk. No one should have to go without a paycheck because of a disaster like this. Executive chef Eddie Lee with Town Point Club says he's offering jobs to cruise ship workers who need it. We'd like to extend some local kindness and uh, be able to help anyone in the food and beverage and hospitality staff that you know may be in need of any type of uh, any type of employment. <laughs> Bully is not alone. General Manager of Brick Anger Brew House Jonathan Almodovar says his team has plenty of positions open. He says this initiative benefits everyone involved. I mean, it's win-win for us because it gives us more employees to take care of anyone that walks in the door. Um, and it also gives us a sense of pride in helping the community. Um, you know, we wouldn't be here without them. Reporting in Norfolk, I'm Ann Sparacco for 13 News Now. And leaders of the company managing the spirit of Norfolk say they're offering full refunds or new bookings for customers who had events scheduled.